Porsche uses a data value referred to as H040 to measure deviations between the mass airflow before and after the throttle plate. This value is used on engines equipped with a mass airflow sensor as well as a MAP sensor to determine throttle angle set point value. The value is displayed as a percentage with a range of plus 49.99 to minus 49.99. Common fault codes like P1070 and P1071 may be stored. If you have a vacuum leak, for example a faulty purge solenoid, leaking intake manifold, or a faulty crankcase breather valve AOS, the deviation will be in the positive direction. This is because of additional air mass in the intake that did not pass through the throttle plate. The DME sees too much air for the current throttle angle. If you have increased throttle angle and less than expected air mass, for example from a dirty throttle plate or leaking throttle plate shaft, the deviation will be in the negative direction. This is because the current air mass in the intake manifold is too little for the current throttle angle. Keep in mind this is not a fuel trim control, rather a calculation of the total deviation using mass airflow, purge activation and fuel trim correction factors compared to the throttle angle. If you have a deviation, use the information here to inform your fuel trim testing. Our subject vehicle, a 970 Panamera with a 3.5 liter engine, has a deviation of about minus 23. This indicates a mass air volume lower than expected at the current throttle angle. An inspection of the throttle plate reveals a cleaning is necessary. Once clean, we'll perform a throttle adaptation. Reviewing H040 deviation after the cleaning and adaptation shows a normal deviation of about minus 3. When checking H040 deviation, expect to see plus or minus 10 with a maximum of plus or minus 15 before you begin to suspect a problem.